Hello everyone and welcome to LEGO Marvel. This is my review of the LEGO Shield Heli Carrier. As you can see there's one of the micro figures there, that's Iron Man. And we've got Nick Fury and a shield agent. Another shield agent there. And then we've got Captain America and Hawkeye there. If we zoom out, get more of the actual vehicle in shot. So, uh, as you can see, it's pretty massive, pretty gargantuan. Uh, it's got some really nice building techniques on it, such as the way that this fits on at an angle. It's very good. I like the design of the propellers. Let's just have a quick look at the minifigures. So we've got Winter Soldier there, came free with the set. Then we've got Hawkeye, Maria Hill, Captain America, Nick Fury and Black Widow. And now I'm going to put some images on screen of the construction of the set. Here's a look at how thick the actual manual is. It's uh, pretty gargantuan, as you can see, and um, also goes into the motorized functions at the back. Uh, but now I'm going to take a look at the motor functions, uh, or rather the power functions of the set. Actually, let's have a quick look at that first of all. This is the stand. Uh, but yeah, here we go. Here's the the motorized functions. You, first of all, you lift this flap to gain access to this portion here that you can lift off. Ironic lift off, uh, and then you've got the motor there, battery box, and then the lights leading to the front. So, if we turn that button on, and then cut that back in, And it's also got lights. So, overall, I really like the power functions on the set. It's probably the best power function I've seen on a set. Uh, I love the size, it's massive. The build was really fun, and there was only uh, one or two repetitive bits, so it was really good. Uh, the minifigures are a really nice selection with a nice display stand, and um, yeah, it took a long, good long while, and I love the design, and it's just fantastic. And really, uh, you know, it's not the worst value thing in the world. It is a very expensive set, but you get a huge amount of large pieces like these, and uh, you know, large panels like this on the side and very long beams and Technic bricks. Uh, so it's really not, not too bad value. I think it's uh, absolutely fantastic. It's, it's actually, it's probably my favourite Lego set of all time. Uh, who'd have thought it? Thank you very much for watching everyone, and subscribe for more videos.